welcome back to my channel. Hey, what's up? How are y'all doing? Oh my god. So, today's video, we are going to be talking about ways to love yourself. Have you ever felt like you don't love yourself enough? Well, in this video, we're gonna be talking about how to love yourself. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Today we'll be talking about loving yourself. Truth be told, many of us don't genuinely love ourselves because we look at um, someone close to us and we see that they are doing better than us. So we tend to like hit ourselves hard and be like, oh, I wish I was like this person. Oh, I wish I was like that person but like you actually really do need to love yourself and to love yourself is to care for yourself is to um understand yourself and understand that you are different no matter no matter how things are around you you need to love yourself loving yourself helps you to go through any obstacle that you are going through like um when you when you truly love yourself you are not going to care what people say even if you you would need to listen because you know sometimes people tell you what they think is wrong or they tell you oh you are looking darker today or oh you're looking fat like well people do tell you things that because you know you cannot see yourself like even when you stand in the front of the mirror you know sometimes you're a lie so like you can't really like see yourself so people see you and they say what they see or what they I what they think they see so it's left for you to like filter those words filter those things that they say to you and then take some and leave some but so, so number one is understanding yourself one way one great way to love yourself is to understand yourself you need to understand you for you not what people are telling you you need to actually sit down and be like okay shady clock who are you what do you love to do or what don't you like to do so like understanding yourself knowing who you are not what people are telling you like you evaluate yourself and be like oh okay i love to cook i love to do this i love to do that so the once you understand yourself it's very easy to love yourself loving yourself you have to really actually understand you because you cannot love what you don't understand am i making sense you cannot love what you don't understand number two is focus on your positives more than your negatives see when you understand yourself you already know that okay i love to do this i don't like to do this so focus more on the things you love to do if you love reading and you hate uh what can i say you hate for instance you you hate um, cleaning but you love reading focus on your reading but at the same time try to work on your cleaning now when you read a lot you tend to be intelligent you tend to be smart so 
if you know you love reading but you don't like cleaning you can read books on cleaning you know try to understand why you have to clean and then just try and work towards it you understand but you are focusing more on reading because when you love to read that means you love to read anything it could be school books it could be magazines it could be your bible it could be anything a journal anything so why not just okay you love to read then read about cleaning and that at the end of the day might boost or like help you to want to clean do you get what i'm trying to say so focus on your positive than your negative so because when you focus more on your negatives then you will just not like yourself you'll be like oh why am i always so dirty why am i always so stubborn why am i always so um these i'm fat i'm too fat i'm not clean i'm not i'm not these i'm not good i'm not no mm -mm. don't do that focus on your positives because it is your positives that will give you the confidence that you need and will keep you happier because in this life you have only one life to live and if you don't enjoy this one life then i don't know so you have one life to live don't let anyone dictate what you should do because at the end of the day people will talk trust me people will talk people will tell you what they think you should do but at the end of the day the choice is yours to do it or not to then another great way to love yourself is to try to socialize like now when i say try to socialize surround yourself socialize with people that love you look not everyone will hate you do you understand even if you have just one person even if you have just one single person that loves you like just surround yourself with people that love you people that understand you it might take a while to find such people it may take a while because you know you have to evaluate and remove add subtract multiply do all those things before you could actually get those people but in order to get people that will love you then you should be ready to love people and you cannot love people if you don't love yourself when you love yourself you're gonna eat what you love you're going to always do the things that you love okay consider imagine you have a, a boyfriend or a girlfriend and you always you know you always want to be around the person you always want to spend time with the person you always want to do what the person likes yeah you would not want to like cause any quarrel you would not want to do anything that can get the person angry do it to yourself love yourself be around yourself have your me time you know if it takes for you to dance in front of the mirror to sing as loud as you can you know just do something that you love and you cannot do what you love if you don't um understand yourself so that's why number one you have to understand yourself number two you have to do what you love number three socialize with people you know try to be around people just try try to be around people that care and love you the moment you notice a negative vibe the the, the moment you sense a negative vibe honey run no jokes 
just try to you know and they thank god for the errors of smartphones you know you have your phones you can go on instagram this is not so healthy because like that will make you addicted and even on instagram and all these social medias these days oh my goodness you have negative people you tend to people um you tend to see people ex like show off probably like their fake lives because yeah most you see most instagram girls you know they go and you think they have all the but sweetheart they've got hats they have applications that help them look so skinny and so beautiful Many of them, their happenings are terrible, bad. When you see them in life, you're like, oh my God, is this really you or, you know? And you know, with the era of filter, make their skin look lighter or make their skin look darker, make their lips pinker, bigger. So, honey, you need to understand, baby. You are good enough, God created you just the way you are if you are small you you have you know the small frontage and the small back without you are beautiful and if you're big like me well honey you are good enough you need to love yourself you need to you just need to shun people and be like yes i'm big so what yes i'm small so what yes i'm short whatever and yes, I'm tall. It's none of your business. God created me like that. So you need to know that God created you. And he loves you. You know? Just let everything about you be positive vibes. Like, any negative vibe, bye-bye. Just show negative vibe. Don't, don't hate yourself. Don't, no, nah, it doesn't work. It, it, it's... It's nothing. It's nothing. Absolutely nothing. Just do what you love doing best. So like me, I like to eat, you know? I like to chop, to whack, you know? You eat that food. Anything. My favorite food is chicken and chips. You know, it comes with the mood though. Sometimes chicken and chips. Sometimes shawarma. Sometimes it is a banner for we roll, you know? Well, if you're not Nigerian, you probably may not even know what a bar and a for is. Don't worry. I will put it down there so you will see the delicacy. It's all beautiful. <laughs> like, oh man. So just understand yourself, love yourself, appreciate yourself. Yes, someone may actually look better than you but it doesn't mean they are better than you like except if deep down within you you're like oh i don't i don't just be like my body shape not because such a person looks like me but because in my head i don't want to be big and or in my head i don't want to be small i just want to have a little body weight not because the society says it but because you actually truly want it, then fine, you can work on it. But if it's because people are making fun of you, if it's because people are talking, honey, you don't need it. You don't. Just be good, okay? And you know, you are the best version of you. I'm telling you, you are. You are the best version of you. You are, you are beautiful. You are smart. You are intelligent. Look, you are perfect the way you are. You know, yeah, people will be like, but nobody's perfect. Nobody has a camera. Yeah, whatever. But that is what I believe. I am perfect the way I am. You, you are also perfect the way you are. So let me be in my perfect lane and you will be in your zone. Okay? All right, guys. That is all for today's video. That's all for today's video. Um, see you guys next time. 
I still remain Shady Clark. Don't forget to be kind to yourself. So, if you are just seeing me for the first time on your screen, baby, click the right button, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, like, comment, and share so that someone can be happy too. Don't forget, be kind to yourself. Bye. Love you. Mwah.